Yes, we are, Nina. Well, I think we're starting a little early. Well, that's today. okay. Because we're. <laughs> I hope everybody's there. Carolina's hey later. <laughs> tell your friends we're on right now from South Carolina. Hey! Yay! yay. Can you believe that's we've all awesome. traveled together? Here we are. Isn't this wonderful how we can do this? We can be anywhere in this world and just come as long as the piano is there. And is there a piano here? Mm -hmm. I mean, look. <laughs> at this beautiful piano. This is the Dino piano. Cheryl, can they see the D on the piano stand? Oh, yes, they this can. This beautiful white piano. This and they can see Mr. Dino, uh, if I miss the light, they can see Mr. Dino above you at this piano. Well, that's something that, that painting. a cousin painted. But anyway, uh -huh. this is our piano. This is. Let me tell you where we are. Let's back up a little bit. Because I think we hit the button too soon, is what happened. I did. I and, always uh, do something. <laughs> we're here a little early, and we just wanted you... Uh, I want to just talk to the folks, Cheryl. Are they seeing me, or are you looking at the piano? I am. Pa I have every bit of you and the piano. Oh, you got the whole thing in here. Okay, That's good. Right. We're in South Carolina. This is where our wonderful children, Cherie, our daughter, and our wonderful son-in-law, Steve, this is where they moved from Kansas, Kansas City to the Greenville area here in South Carolina. It is beautiful here. We came, we, we, dra we drove right straight through. Yes, we did. You know, we couldn't wait. So we got here. It took about, I don't know, 15 hours. Something like But uh, I just sat back, relaxed, and showed did most of the driving. But we're here in South Carolina, and we've been here for like several days, and it's absolutely beautiful here. Oh, my. It is a gorgeous area. And we are just thrilled to be here with our kids. And not only our kids, but our granddaughters. Have they seen the photograph, Cheryl, on the piano? I'm going to show Those them right now. Those are our two granddaughters. That's Lauren, right there to the right. And there's Alexandra. And Alexandra is pregnant. Yes. With baby. We saw the photographs today. That's in her tummy. And uh, anyway, and I noticed the fingers. I think they're going to be long fingers to play the piano. <laughs> I that did notice that right away. a wonderful right. thing. <laughs> and Lauren, our sweet Lauren, has uh, has given birth of two beautiful children. And that's Maeve and Oscar. Yes. And you know what? They were here today. We were able to babysit them all day today and enjoy every so bit cute. of it. But here we are, and this is the piano that perhaps you've never seen before. This is a Baldwin piano that was made especially. Cheryl designed this piano. You see it's a little Greek. A uh, little Greek design here. Sure, what do they call this? The Greek key. This is called the Greek key, and this is the Greek D. And the big D. <laughs> and the big D. D <laughs> and for Dino, here, did you forget? You know the D for Dino? <laughs> down here it says Dino yes. on the side, and Baldwin. And uh, it's a, a little over five foot, but I'm telling you, for a five foot, it plays beautifully. It's got a great yes. sound. As a matter of fact, uh, the Baldwin Company asked me to come and uh, give them an idea of what I liked as far as the action and the sound and that sort of thing. So this is a Dino piano. At one time, they sold these pianos. Of course, Baldwin is no longer existing, but uh, a lot of folks did get this piano and it's kind of neat. It really, really yes. is. It's a great piano. So let me play a little bit and then we're gonna talk and we take a little sip of coffee. Oh, and my cool. Dino cup. Can you, you see know, it there, Cheryl? I can see it. That's a Dino cup. I sure can. My daughter Cherie collects all the Dino stuff, so here it is. We don't, we don't, do we have any of these? We don't have any. No, these, sir, Cheryl. we don't. I don't know where they all went, but probably yeah, we gave them all cool. away. <laughs> the coffee and I also brought from Branson Fire Cafe my coconut cookie that I like a lot. This comes in lemon and coconut, so I like the coconut. Okay, anyway, so let me play something. Someone quick. just asked again. What's that, Cheryl? Where are we in South Carolina? In the Greenville area. Greenville yes, area. Yes, the That's Greenville right. area. Beautiful, beautiful. And if you're from Carolina, south or north, let us know. Okay, I want to know if I have some friends here in Carolina. Because we may be able to get together while we're here. We're going to be here for two or three weeks. And there may be a time that we can maybe meet in Greek. Greek. Meet and greet with the Greek. <laughs> with the Meet Greek. and greet with the Greek. So Cheryl and I would love to meet you personally. And uh, we'll tell you exactly 
the specifics on that. But right now, we don't know. We're setting it up where some of you folks from the Carolina area maybe can come and just have a cup of coffee and maybe I'll have ship some co not the coconut cream, cream. ship some carrot cake here in Carolina so we can have a little meet and greet with coffee and cake and just enjoy the blessings of the Lord. I'll tell you what, when I look around here and I see the beauty of South Carolina, uh, and I walk every Gorgeous. morning. I walk, 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 and it's so the foliage is beautiful. It mm -hmm. really, really is. And um, I've been able to relax. Do I look relaxed? <laughs> I feel relaxed. I got to rest today and yesterday and the day before. And, and uh, actually, That's we're getting ready to go to New York. We're going to be in Cambridge, New York to see my sister this weekend. So we're going to drive all the way there. I must really love my sister and brother in law. That's all I can say. How far is it? It's 800 it's miles. But we'll make it. It's miles. worth it. In Cambridge, New York. We'll go to Cambridge, New York, where someday we're going to have our, our meeting in the air, or our tent meeting. I'm going to go there and scope it out. So we can all meet there, too. I'm telling you, we're going to travel. We're going to travel. As long as the Lord has returned. If he returns, we'll travel, all right. That's right. In the twinkling, <laughs> In the twinkling of an eye. It won't take 16 oh. hours to get there. Praise the Lord. Oh, wow. <laughs> so let me play something so you can hear this piano.
like being here in S South Carolina. With How do you mountains. like it here, Cheryl? The mountains are beautiful. The trees, well, they're not very many mountain mountains, no. but the trees are dynamic. They're gorgeous. And the weather, it's breezy here all the time. You know what? I think my favorite month of the year is September. Okay. Just coming out of the really hot weather mm. and coming into this beautiful breeze into the fall, October. Uh, I wish we were going to be upstate New York beginning of October, but we can't fit it in our schedule. It's going to be next week when we're there, but I'm sure it's going to be beautiful there also. It will be. So we're doing our little kind of tour. Cheryl and I, we just got in the car with our little Macy, Nico. We didn't take Nico with us. That's our, our new dog. <laughs> And uh, we staying at a wonderful place, and we've been calling every day to see how Nico's doing. And getting friend... pictures. Did we get a picture yet of him? Oh, yes. Oh, we I didn't see it, Cheryl. Today. Well, I'll have to show oh, you. Oh, I gotta see it, yes. What we got today. Yes. That's my Nico boy. He's a sweetie. That's my Nico boy. Well, praise God. You know, this song, made of ice. that says Saved your soul. Baptized you. Baptized you. Made, made you whole. Praise God. Stop and let me tell you. Oh, and I hope 
hope he's done wonderful oh, and marvelous things for you and this week, the last two days. I know there are people that need prayer. So many of you have sent a request and said, please pray for me. Amen. I got a friend that's got COVID, and that's my best friend. I'm praying that he will be healed or she'll be healed. Oh, that demonic thing that's come to this world. It is we rebuke it in the name of Jesus. I pray that you are covered, covered by the power of God, by yes. the healing hand of God, that you yes. will not, God. not receive any of that virus. I will not speak it. Mm. We are determined not to receive that virus in the name of Jesus. We are determined that cancer will not come upon us. We pray for those who do have cancer. My sister Chris called me just before the session and says, Dino, please, please pray. I've got a dear friend here oh, near where I live. Yes. Dear, dear family. And their son was stricken with cancer at age 34. Cancer of the brain. And I said, Chris, I'm going to have my power prayer force pray for that young man. Yes, we do. And I want you all right now to just as we just focus on let's let's focus on cancer right now. God will heal cancer, whether it's skin. There's something that's a skin cancer. I pray that healing that will dissolve in the name of Jesus. Yes. Lord. I pray for the cancer of the of the lungs and, and again of the brain. I oh, dear Jesus. Thank oh Lord, for your in the name of Jesus, Thank we for ask for healing, healing right now for that young man. Thank you, Lord, that you are I with pray us for healing for that times. lady that's watching right now that's suffering with, with cancer, going through chemo. Lord, I pray yes, Jesus. that if the chemo can wipe it out, that's a miracle in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Father, I pray for anyone that's got cancer right now, that healing miraculously through these airwaves right now. Wouldn't it be wonderful if everybody that was watching with cancer would be healed by the power of God? What a testimony that would be to Jesus. the world. We receive that in the name of Jesus. Cancer be gone. Father, I pray you come upon that young man, the top of his head, to throughout his whole body. Yes. He will feel the, the anointing and the healing power. Yes, Jesus. Jesus, what you've done for those that were on this earth and you laid your hands on them, they were healed instantly. That could happen today. We ask for an instant miracle. In the name of Jesus. Let's all pray right now for those that are hurting Lord, Lord, physically Lord, with the Lord, cancer. Thank you that you are listening Jesus, to us. Jesus, Jesus. I Lord, pray, Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus that healing. Healing virtues. That's that all I can ask. The only way I could ask, I just say healing, Lord. Healing of God, that Spirit, cancer. We praise you. Healing of whatever Jesus, disease is represented Lord. here this evening on this Facebook. We thank you for the time that we can come together and share with our friends, no matter where we are, whether it's in Branson, Missouri, whether it's in South Carolina or New York, wherever we go, Thank you, Lord. may we be followed by the Holy Spirit. May it be upon us for protection. And Father, if you give us the opportunity to lay hands on people where we go to these different places, we want to do that because it's, it says the word of God. When one or two are gathered together, and there are many right now that are gathered together on this Facebook. Yes, Lord, we thank you. We praise you. We praise you, Lord. Let's just praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord to know that we know that we know beyond a shadow of a doubt God. that God is alive. He's a mighty God. The mighty God. Praise the power God. of God. In our lives. Right now, we receive it. And we once again sing. Let's just praise. Come on, sing it.
anointing of the Holy Spirit.
prayer warriors out there watching. And I know th throughout this whole time I was playing that people were praying for one another. Yes. That's what's so great about this Facebook, yes. that we can be together and just share our burdens with each other and just let God come into our lives right. and fill us with his peace, especially in this day that we're living in. You know, we pray for our nation and for those in Afghanistan, we have not yes, forgotten we have not any forgotten of it. Them. No. And we just are believing. And I pray God. our president doesn't forget them either. Yes. Don't turn your back on those precious missionaries That's right. that have given their lives. Yes. And I've heard some, some really heartbreaking reports. I was talking to Kenneth Copeland the other day. We were just sharing about those that are in Afghanistan that have shared the gospel of Jesus Christ and they're actually being beheaded and being beaten and, and, and in front of their families. And so it's just absolutely outrageous what the devil is, is doing there and what we've allowed the devil to do. I'm not gonna get into politics right now, but we pray, Lord, that you be with those that are there. I can't imagine how they're hidden right now and trying to stay, get, get away from that enemy, the devil, that comes around to destroy and, and to kill. Him. So Father, I pray for our nation. Right now. I pray for our president. Oh, Jesus, I pray for him. Pray. Renew his mind. <laughs> Father, if he'll open his mind and his heart to you. Yes, Lord. And those that surround him at the White House. But I pray that there are many Christians around this world yes, there are. that know how to get on their knees and pray for this nation, for the world, for those countries Thank you, Lord. that need God. Each one. Oh, I'm telling you something, folks. The rapture's about to take place. <laughs> That's the next thing. In Listen, I've been, I've been studying like you have with uh, Tiff Shuttlesworth. Shuttlesworth. Oh, I'm telling you guys, don't miss it. Today I spent at least two hours sitting outside this beautiful weather and listening to Tiff, how he prophetically explains what the Word of God says in Revelation and in Daniel, Nehemiah, and all these great men of God that have, God has given vision yes. to what's about to happen to this world. Thank oh, it's so, so great, it's so interesting. It's so wonderful to, to know a man like Pastor Tiff that has studied and has spent hours and hours of time in prayer and studying the Word of God, and now we can share from that. Praise you, Lord. I'll tell you what, he's a man for this hour. Yes, he is. I'll tell you, I've been to church all, practically all my life, and I, <laughs> I, I haven't heard 
some things that he has shared from the word of God. It's all from the word of God. It brings such clarity to oh, the word clarity. of God. Such clarity to the Bible. <laughs> and it lets you know where we are in, in uh, timelines of what God is doing. And I've gone back several times and listened to him over and over again and mm -hmm. take notes. As a matter of fact, he likes you when you do that, take notes. He's like our, our, our he's a teacher. Yes, he is. He's a teacher. The marvelous teacher. And study. Study the Word of God through this amazing man of God. Yes. He has such intelligence and wisdom. It's just amazing. Just amazing. And we thank God for every minister that is yes. teaching. Just so it's from the Word. From the Word. It's not just their interpretation. No. We don't have to go to interpretation. All we have to do is read the Word. It tells you right there yes. what's happening, what's about to happen, what has happened already. And if you'll study the word, you will see that we're at the point of rapture. Are you ready to, re to, to, to be caught up in the air? What I love about Pastor Tim, he always gives people the opportunity to accept Christ at the end of yes, each study. Is. And I'll tell you what, when you listen to him, if you're not a Christian, <laughs> you, it'll, it'll scare the you know what <laughs> out of you. You know what I'm saying? Cheryl just gave me a, a terrible looking face. Well, but it does. I mean, that's exactly what it does. There's so much. It'll, I'll tell you, you want to get on your knees and so you'll accept in Christ into your heart. Forgive me, I said, because I want to be ready. Keep our lamps trimmed and burning. Yes. yes that yes, they yes, don't yes. go out. That the minute that right. our eyes, I mean, in the twinkling of your eye, be caught away into the blessing of the Lord. And eternity. And glory. John saw that city. The new Jerusalem. praise, give him glory, and know that and all that transpires, he is still right here. He is. And one of these days... He's not moved or surprised. One of these days, one not of these too long days. from now, we're going to bow down before him. Yes. Our King of Kings and Lord of Lords. And we're going to sing new songs. How new songs. Know. I can't wait. Oh, I pray, oh, Lord, thank I, you, I want to accompany the choir in heaven. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> if not, I'll just sing in that choir. But I pray that you too someday will sing in that heavenly choir. Yes. Hosanna in the highest, our King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Amen. Dino, would you lead those who don't know Jesus that may, may have joined us, may have joined us to the saving knowledge well, the of The Bible says that we confess our sins. He is faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. All we got to do, it's so simple, folks. Will come as a child. That's all. It's all it, as a little child. Simplicity is some profound. Say, Father, forgive me of my sins. Come into my heart. I want to be ready. I want to receive that eternal life, which is the gift of God. We we'll receive Him as a Savior and Master. Thank you, Father. And I pray that you prayed that prayer. And you know beyond a shadow of a doubt. You will be in heaven. No more cancer. 
Isn't that wonderful? Oh, yes, it is. No more sickness. No more dying. Mm -hmm. Can you fathom what it's going to be like? Rejoicing. And rejoicing a thousand years of them. We're going to do that takes enough level, I'm telling you. Praise when you hear the word of God and what's going to happen when you're after the rapture, oh, it's going to be absolutely amazing. Such victory. Absolutely amazing. Such Praise victory. God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, and thank you for watching. What are you playing with? I'm baby? playing with my this cookie right Crinkling here. Crinkling and crackling. I was going to eat in front of everybody, but I got so caught up with Oh, hallelujah. Let's playing let's in the spirit. Worship the Lord. But anyway, people know uh, so many have already gotten this cookie. Yes. If my sister's watching, hers is in the mail. It's coming very, very soon. She hasn't, I haven't sent it to her yet, <laughs> but I'm going to do it. Uh -oh. And uh, it comes in lemon and it comes in coconut and you'll love it. Let this be, let this, let this be like almost, uh, I should say it, a ministry, invite your friends over and share. Yes. In fact, why don't you invite yes. them over during Facebook time? And just sit around the TV or whatever and just Amen. have some cookies and, and some of my and some of your cough, coffee and let's just, some, tea or just whatever, yeah. enjoy the fellowship and turn dino on. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Continue to pray for us as we travel. And this is a uh, very wonderful rest that we're getting. And uh, it's been it's a lot of work in Branson, and, but that's okay. We're working until Jesus comes. That's right. And then if this happens, I will let you know about meeting somewhere here in Greenville, South Carolina. I would love, Cheryl, I would love to meet you personally. I want you to come out and just say hi. Okay, I may play yeah. one or two songs on the piano because wherever it is, it's gotta be a piano for sure. Okay? Okay, we love you. Share this now. Please share this with like, all your friends so they can also experience the Spirit of God as I play and to receive their miracle. Amen. 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 Okay. Praise you. We'll talk to you later. Love you. Maybe from New York. <laughs>